Hello, everybody. No, it's Monkey. Hello. Uh, welcome to our reaction to. Today we're continuing with our Cobra Kai reactions. We're in season two, episode four, and Mom's right on cue. Mm -hmm. The moment of truth. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to watch a full length reaction to this episode, you can find it out on my Patreon link too in the description box. Okay. Last episode. <clears throat> Man, Daniel was given this presentation. Oh. He was gonna do his ice thing. And Johnny <coughs> swooped in, did the fire thing. I will say this. Hmm. I feel like the fire thing's not as impressive as the ice because you put wood on fire, wouldn't that inherently make it not as strong because it's already starting to burn? I feel like they'd make it almost easier to break it than just pure ice. I, I thought it was bricks he burnt. I mean, cut and slice with his hand. Was it bricks? It looked like was it wood? It looked like a big stack of like wood. Oh, I don't know. I wasn't paying I don't attention. Know. I mean, they did start a fire. How the heck they start bricks on fire? I think it's wood, ma. <laughs> but like it was like a bit like stack of wood. <clears throat> yeah, but it would take a lot that for that fire would have to really burn through that wood to make it weak, though. It wouldn't make it that weak that fast. Yeah, but I still feel like I don't know, man. That ice, man. We want to see Daniel do that. Ugh, I'm bummed. But see, you could say once the ice starts to melt, it weakens it. Well, it wasn't melting until they got that, until I got that <laughs> fire going. The minute he brought it out, it was it was going to be as strong as it was. And then, because they got distracted with Cobra Kai, that's when it started melting. I know, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just I'm saying. I'm, why are you picking Johnny's side? Because <laughs> he's the underdog. Daniel's now the underdog because he's trying to get his dojo up and running and no one wants to go. Daniel's not really an underdog right now. Daniel has it all. He has a, don't like Daniel. He has a Daniel. good job, a beautiful wife, a loving family. Yeah, but he just wants to teach kids the way of Miyagi. I know, I'm just saying. That's I'm sweet. trying to root for the underdog. I think Daniel's underdog at this point because look at how successful Cobra's Kai is being. And I'm talking about their dojos. And his dojo isn't as successful as Cobra Kai. You know? He's uh, trying well, to get it off the I'm ground. talking about his life. I'm talking about the dojo. Oh, okay. Let's just watch the show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about this specific incident. Well, and what difference does it make if Daniel gets his off the ground? It's free anyway. So it's because not like he he's wants to money teach. Up. It's not about the money. <laughs> that karate's never about the money. <laughs> It's about the lessons and the spirit and the heart of it. And the kids at Cobra Kai are getting corrupted. Look at little Miguel. I look know. at Stig and Eli. I know. You know? But look at Robbie. Look at how much he's grown as mm -hmm. a better person under Daniel's mentorship. But look at how crappy Miguel and Eli have gotten under Johnny's influence. Mm -hmm. That's saying something. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to have to root for Daniel to get his dojo up and running off the ground and getting more students and inspiring and helping more people. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying. Okay. What do you guys, comment down below how you feel. <coughs> you on Johnny's side? You on Daniel's <laughs> side? Are you neutral? Are you sw you're like, I'm Switzerland. Let me know. Let's go. Is that Dimitri? Yeah. Hello? I was a little afraid you'd be the other guy. Oh, oh god. my god. Uh, not He's gonna pick here. Don't get too close. I'm not sure it's anatomically correct. You see, the hood of the Indochinese spitting cobra is Jesus much Dimitri. Smaller, and their pupils are actually round. Way to respect boundaries. I'm nervous. Pupils. <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> Punched him! That's why I keep thinking maybe he's gonna join Daniel's dojo. Oh, yeah. So what exactly are we supposed to do? Go to the mall and pick a fight? Look for us defending ourselves? Not the worst idea. No. Uh, it's a terrible idea. Yeah. Let me tell you about my first job selling cars. <laughs> he's like, I uh, don't care. Car lot in Tarzana. Okay. Oh, yeah. What are we doing? Robbie. We're gonna take a drive. We're gonna go, uh, go cruising through town. House to house. Yeah. You don't get to raise it again just because I have more students. This is exactly what I'm doing. You <laughs> have more students, you have more money. You have more money, you pay more rent. That's yeah? lame. I... Rwanda was no joke. Don't you mean Somalia? 
Mogadishu issues in Somalia. Rwanda is a whole different country. Mm. Oh, this is making these stories up. Straighten up, Ginger Twins. <laughs> ginger Twins. <laughs> it's so terrible. I should laugh. Hey, it's that Sorry, one guy. Sorry, can't stay for class. You'll at least have a chance of becoming a fighter. Yeah, he should open up to like adult that, classes and then like classes for like teenagers so. and kids. Oh. Oh, you will, huh? I saw your little demo at Valley Fest. Yeah, who's this? Some random Mr. girl. Diggs. A new uh, love interest for Miguel. All about. I'm not in it. I'm not here for that. <laughs> Miguel don't deserve <clears throat> love. So he shapes up. You want to do oh! oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah, who is she? I don't know, but obviously she does know some karate or something. No. No. With a Y. Okay, Tori, who are you? With a Y. Seriously. Hey, Jack the Rocher, he's got a kid at West Valley, doesn't he? Uh, son, I think, yeah. Huh. Okay, Daniel. You all right? Yeah, yeah I just kind of used to work here. Mm. Really? When? A couple of days last summer. Ooh, what happened? My love. Oh. It was aggravated assault, Eli. I looked up. That's a year in prison and a $10,000 fine. Stop being such a bitch, Dimitri. You know what happened? You stop being such a douchebag, Hawk. He's not Cobra Kai material. <laughs> Guy's got his issues, but everyone deserves a second chance. Uh, I don't know about that. All right? There's nothing to worry about. Ugh. On top of it. No, you're not, Johnny. Chris is feeding your ego. Right? You think he's a changed man. He's not. He's gonna come back to bite you in the butt at some point. I'm going old school. Oh, yeah? What you up to? Funny you should ask. <laughs> <laughs> Putting his car salesman <laughs> on. First case. Fight breaks out. We can record it. Ah! What? So Cobra Kai's wrong? It's not wrong, it's just... Aggressive. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> so it's just you and Abs all summer. <laughs> yep. Yeah. God, that must be hard. <laughs> okay. What did I say would happen if you ever mm. stepped foot in here again? Uh -oh. I'm calling the cops. <gasps> oh. uh, what's going on here? Robbie is our guest. Period. What do you do? I don't know. Oh, I want to know. I mean, we know Robbie's done some like illegal stuff. Do you have any idea of what I'm capable of? Because if it's a war that you're looking for, who's he talking to? One, I'll burn the whole damn place down if I have to. Wow. Yeah. yeah, is he talking burning Johnny's place down, or? I have no clue. Hey, Sandra. Daniel's just telling us about his new dojo. Who would have thought that karate would be the thing that turned everything around for my Aisha? Really? Is she one of your students, Daniel? Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Uh, uh, Cobra Kai. No. <laughs> it's the best thing that ever happened to her. Wow. Oh. 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 Real rough patch. Sandra, stop talking, what? please. Say Lawrence. Cobra Kai. Didn't they do that <laughs> thing at Valley Fest? Uh. Yeah, they said it was like a Van Halen concert. Yeah. Poor Daniel. John, your car is a dead giveaway and who you are. You didn't know that, right? <laughs> oh, he's thinking of Mr. Miyagi. Plenty still out there. If you've got something worth biting, eventually the fish will find you. You remember that, Daniel? Patience. He's like a young Mr. Miyagi <laughs> reincarnated. <laughs> Patience, young grasshopper. And Miyagi's like, yeah, I'm sending messages to people from beyond the grave to remind you, Daniel. Spread out, I'm sure it'll turn up. Aisha's friend. Beach. He Maybe might know Tori, I wonder. Maybe, like, he used to hang out with her. Sam, I'm walk away. Walk away. Don't! Sam, no! Oh, oh. Sam! Don't! Oh! <laughs> oh. He didn't do something, did he? Is it recording now? That's cool. We can give you a refresher course. 
Bring it. Ow! <laughs> oh, oh my god! Okay. Ravi, you guys just come on. Oh! Oh my god! Daniel. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Coach Robbie's recording it all. Wait, get the wallet. Get your phone. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, the wallet. <laughs> they got uh, these bullshit psychiatrists now. Mm, well, a lot. <laughs> that sounds an awful lot like defeat. Of course, it's gonna um, string it on Johnny's heart. Street. Yeah. Yes, Sensei. Yeah. Oh my God. Yes, Sensei. Yeah, but it's it's gonna I come know. back to bite him. We know it is. Something good did come out of it, though. <laughs> He's like, oh, I might have recorded that. He's like, you can't Hi, judge me. Don't. Yeah. No. Nope. You can't. Not like that. No. Yeah. Yagi Do is about defending yourself and protecting others. Excuse me. Yeah, what did I say? It was unclear if I knew was going to. I was supposed to ring the doorbell. Yeah, I want to learn karate. <laughs> I knew Dimitri was going to show up. He's like, what did I say? What did I just come to the right place? He just had to be patient. <laughs> Sensei Kreese, you want to take this one? Mm. Certainly, Sensei Lai. I can't stand it. I'm so not in the mood tonight. <laughs> you guys, it's just been a night, okay? It's not the show. I'm just in a mood, and so seeing some of this put me more in a mood, if you know what I mean. Discussion time. Okay. Well, Daniel, he was trying different ways to get new students and he tried approaching some of the parents <coughs> yeah. and Sandra or Sandra whatever came in swooped in and was like oh yeah my daughter Aisha yeah you know <laughs> she goes to Cobra Kai yeah, Cobra Kai yes yeah, Sensei Lawrence like saved her life <laughs> like oh Jesus Sandra I'm like no no mm. um and <laughs> Daniel he was walking on the beach and he thought he saw a guy that reminded no, me of yeah. Mr. Miyagi he was like a young version of him or something. And um, this guy was like talking about how fishing, you know, you gotta be patient. There's plenty of fish in the sea. We're just waiting to take a bite. It's gotta be patient. Just waiting for them to come to me. And Dan was like, that's right, patience. Well, Robbie ran into his old buddies. No, oh, yeah. And he was like, oh, I got the perfect idea. We can record <laughs> yeah. me fighting them. But then he got boats in the head. But Daniel showed up and he kicked their butt. <clears throat> but he couldn't use the video. No. It's not about the credit. It's never about that. But then Dimitri showed up. Yeah. Well, Dimitri at the beginning went to Cobra Kai and Kreese punched him. Well, granted, Dimitri was a little forward, like Dimitri, no shade, but you don't walk up to someone and just touch him on their arm oh. like that. Like, okay. I mean, not that Dimitri deserved to be no. punched, but I'm just saying, like, Dimitri, come on, dude. Come on. Uh, I mean, Dimitri can be kind of like a little bit of annoying know it all. Right. Um, but yeah, he showed up at, at, at um, Daniel's dojo because, you know, I kept saying Dimitri's going to show up. Dimitri's going to show up because he wanted to learn karate but not have to like, right. get physically hurt. So I figured he'd show up. And the look on Daniel's face at the end was like, oh my God, it worked. Mr. Miyagi <laughs> sent me a message. I just had to be patient. Um, and we got a new girl, Tori. And... Her and I used to become friends. I yeah. can't help but wonder if maybe more than friends? You know, like, like if they'll become more than friends oh, or something? Oh, I don't know. I don't know if they'll just be friendly. I don't know. I kind of got, maybe, maybe they'll just be friends. But I felt like when they were in the, uh, not grocery store, um, what do you call it? Not grocery, gas station? No. What do you call that? Like, the 7-Eleven, what do you call that? Convenience store? Uh, yeah, whatever. When they were in that store. I felt like I got like a flirty vibe from her. Mm. But oh, I, I guess I didn't pick up on that. But That's what I picked up on, but I could be wrong. Mm. But, you know, I don't know. Yeah, very nice. Anyway, don't matter. But she's trouble. She's doing that vodka. 
But Sam accused her of stealing the wallet. And I was like, Sam, no. Because I'm thinking, what, 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 what would Tori need out of that, you know? And, um, of course, they just pissed at her. Oh, Chris is at a homeless shelter. Mm. And, of course, Chris is all like, oh, you know, Johnny, this has just been my life. <laughs> of course, Johnny's all like, oh, I believe in second chances. So now Chris is sensei. He's a fellow sensei. Somebody take this and just, I just need a, something, man. Seriously. Can't with this show. Just irritated tonight. Oh my God, I'm so irritated. <laughs> but I am happy that for Daniel, he got a new student. You know, he has such a good heart. He really does. That's it. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Alrighty. Well. Okay. I'm tired too. I'm I'm not tired. I'm, I'm just, tired. I'm, just, I'm I'm cranky tonight, so I apologize. <laughs> it's nothing to do with the show. The show made me well. The show makes me frustrated, but in a good way. Don't worry. <laughs> okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed our reaction to this episode. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you're not your full length, you can find it on my Patreon, like usual. And have a beautiful one for today. Good night. Guys.